हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू आवर चैनल नेटवर्किंग विद गुरु जी वट वाई हाउ टूडे इन दिस सीरीज वी विल डिस्कस इंटरव्यूल एंड राउटिंग वट इज इंटरव्यूल एंड राउटिंग इंटरव्यूल एंड राउटिंग इज द एबिलिटी टू राउट और सेंड ट्रैफिक बिटवीन व्हील एंड दैट आर नॉर्मली ब्लॉक बाई डिफॉल्ट वाई डू वी नीड इंटरव्यूल एंड राउटिंग Interval routing allows for greater flexibility in network design, improves security and increased performance. Interval routing also simplifies network administration and can reduce the cost of network infrastructure. How do we configure interval routing? Interval routing have three methods. First, separate physical gateway on router. Second, using sub interfaces. This is also known as router on a stick. third using layer 3 switch let's start with the first separate physical gateway on router in this we can see we have connecting the router with two separate physical link for two vlans vlan 10 and 20 so we will configure on router the gateways for the switches so we are configuring the ips in below figure we are configuring the vlans now here we are configuring the particular vlan which is connected to the router now here we can see now we are able to ping both vlans due to router second option is using sub interfaces that is router on a stick here we will connect the router and switch using a single link and so now here what we are doing we are creating the sub interfaces at router for particular vlan first we are creating the sub interface for vlan 10 so here we are using the encapsulation dot 1 vlan 10 and then we are providing the ip the gateway ip second we are doing the same for the vlan 20 now we can again see after doing this configuration we are able to ping both vlans the third option is using layer 3 switch so the layer 3 switch are which is capable of doing the routing In the first figure we can see we are creating the virtual interfaces on our l3 switch or layer 3 switch interface vlan 10 we configure the ip which is the gateway ip for that vlan for vlan 10 it is 192.168.10.100 and vlan 20 192.168.20.100 to enable the ip routing we give the command ip routing so by using or doing this configuration we can still communicate between vlans thank you for watching please like comment share and subscribe